All right, music fans, welcome back. Harmless Dave here uh, talking about uh, yesterday and what happened and a uh, few things, a few observations I have and uh, how I'm going to move forward. So I had posted a video. Uh, that video is no longer up. So if you didn't get a chance to see that video, um, well, it... it it had to come down because I, I made an agreement with the other person involved that uh, he would uh, remove the video about me and I would remove the video about him or at least about the situation about him. Um, so that was done yesterday. Uh, I've had a few people reach out to me and ask me what's going on and so forth. And I've tried to answer the best uh, that I can on that issue. I got really sick last night. Like at one point I was just begging for mercy cuz it I had stomach pains like I've never had before in my entire life. And I attribute the whole day and even last night to just taking the bait, taking if if you're a patron or a follower of this channel and you're dealing with something outside this channel and you want to point it out to me. Um, what I would do instead is point it out to the person in question, complain to the person that is putting this out. If you can, if you can't, then you know what I would do? Just don't even entertain it. Don't, don't even engage with it because yesterday to me felt like a spiritual attack. I know I'm into that kind of weird stuff. People would just say, you brought this on yourself, which is, I admit to taking the bait. And uh, that was a mistake. But then um, once you open the door, uh, you you give a foothold for the enemy who comes right in there and just uh, starts wailing on you. I mean, it made no sense last night that I felt like there was a bowling ball in my stomach last night. It just was something bizarre. Uh, and all I can attribute it to is some kind of a spiritual attack. Uh, and it's really not worth engaging with this anymore. Um, think of it. You're going to meet a lot of people in your lifetime, but there are going to be so many people that engage with you on social media and people who watch my channel, people who are even subscribed or people who are patrons or YouTube members or coffee buyers, which I appreciate yesterday very much, all those people that stepped forward. Um, I appreciate all of that stuff, but guess what? I'm probably not going to meet more than a fraction, a very tiny fraction of, of people uh, who support me. And I'm not saying that to say that I don't care about you guys. And I do, I care a lot about you guys, but I have to look at life that, you know, the, the most important people in my life are my family and uh, the few friends that I have. Um, and that's it. And so I have to, to kind of just get over the fact that um, there are certain people that care more about what I do on this channel sometimes than I do. That's, that's the truth. It would be good just to crawl uh, into the corner and get into the fetal position and just say, you know what? I don't want to do this anymore. I don't. Now, people told me, hey, you know, you need to continue. Don't let this get you down. The typical encouragement, which I appreciate. Um, I don't really feel like I want to keep going, but I'm, of course I'm going to keep going. Of course. I don't know what I need to say other than what I normally say, which is the music industry is in rough shape, at least the kind of music that I like to listen to. But I would argue that the music industry leaning heavily on people like, you know, Taylor Swift is, is like your most important figure today in the music world. Like she's bigger than the Beatles, really. Um, that would indicate that we're in a pretty dark place musically as far as what people are now listening to and enjoying. But as soon as I step out and say that, that's a critical comment. I should just say, wow, all those Taylor Swift people, it's great. It's fantastic how many there are and you know what they're all about. But I I I can't really get on board with that. 
So I've noticed, and this dates back to the very beginning of when I started doing this channel, that I would do videos and I would say, you know, it's kind of weird. I have opinions about these things and I'm expressing them. And people are coming along and they're like, well, no, you're supposed to just like everything. Why don't you just like everything? And as time goes on, I've become more of that guy on the front porch uh, yelling at the kids to get off the lawn. And I acknowledge that. And I've uh, taken up that mantle and I've um, gladly uh, will continue doing that kind of stuff. But that's really not my goal in life. My goal in life is honestly to tell people about Jesus Christ. That's kind of my goal. And you and I may see differently when it comes to spiritual matters, but I'm still going to say, hey, it's hopeless. It's completely hopeless without God, um, regardless of how I behave. All right. My behavior is not a reflection on Jesus Christ. He's the same yesterday, today, and forever. I am a flawed sinner. Okay. And uh, I am not claiming perfection. In fact, um, the video I took down was kind of like a confession. Like a lot of the things that uh, I failed at in my life. And uh, I feel fortunate to have gotten to this place where I'm talking to certain people. I'm doing interviews on occasion. I'm engaged with uh, some great people who have decided to support me. And so I can't really ask for anything better than that. Plus, I've got a great family, and I've got a pretty good life. Uh, I don't know why I was in so much pain last night, but my guess is that uh, the emotions and all of this stuff that happened yesterday kind of just snowballed and and literally made me sick. Uh, I haven't eaten anything since, uh, I don't know, like almost 24 hours ago now. So... In any event, folks, I just wanted to give folks an update. The channel isn't going anywhere, all right? It's not going anywhere. Um, I will persist. It's a very slow news day today. So uh, you may not see me again today, but who knows? Maybe you will. Maybe something uh, will be sent uh, by Tony or another one of my great researchers who uh, pretty much every day are sending me links. I get links from certain rock stars. And uh, they send me a ton of stuff. There's one guy in particular who I've had on here who is just, <laughs> he's at the tip of the spear. He is um, very smart, very smart man. And uh, I, I appreciate his friendship as well. So in any event, folks, God bless everyone. Sorry for the rambling and just the word salad here. When you think of word salad, who do you think of? You think of me? Or do you think of Kamala Harris? I think of Kamala Harris more than I would think of, of me. But maybe, you know, maybe someone else has got word salad down to a science more so than anyone else. But um, I'm grateful and I will uh, I'm grateful for the word salad and I'll talk to you soon.